Hey everyone, it's Vincent here, and this is Tech Walkthrough. This video serves as a brief guide to setting up the business intelligence tools in Excel. There are four of them Power Query, Power Pivot, 3D Map, and Power View. In the video, you might notice that there is no setup required for a few of the tools. And for a few of the tools, you might notice that their availability is quite depending on the Excel version that you have. So let's get on to it. Power Query. Power Query is a tool for extracting, transforming, and loading data. It comes with all Microsoft 365 versions, which means no installation is required. It also comes with Excel 2016 Professional Plus and all versions of Excel 2019. Power Query needs to be installed if you are having Excel 2010 Professional Plus or 2013 Professional Plus. This is not one important point. Yeah? Power Query is not available and not installable in versions other than Excel 2010 Professional Plus or Excel 2013 Professional Plus. It is strictly Professional Plus when it comes to Excel 2010 or 2013. Power Query is not available in Home, Student and Business Editions found in 2013 or 2016. Let's see how Power Query looks like. On the screen, I have Excel for Microsoft 365. So this also applies for Excel 2016 Professional Plus and 2019 as well. Go to the Data tab, look for Get and Transform Data. Now on the ribbon, the Excel 2016 will display only get and transform. Please note that. Power Query is integrated with these versions of Excel and there's no further work required. That's it for Power Query. And if you go to Deliverable and under COM add-ins, I find that I can't check or uncheck any boxes relating to Power Query because the option is not there and it comes built in. I also included the reference links for Power Query in the video below. Let's move on to Power Pivot. Power Pivot. Power Pivot is a tool for modeling data. Usually the data consists of relational tables. It comes with Microsoft 365 all versions and like Power Query, no installation is required for these versions. It also comes with Excel 2016 Professional Plus and all versions of Excel 2019 and Excel 2013 Professional Plus. The first thing you have to do relating to Power Query is to go to Developer, Com Add-ins in the ribbon, and look for the Power Keyword for Excel box. Please make sure that it's checked, and if it's not checked, please tick and click OK once you're done with it. That's it for the setup for Power Keyword. I've included reference and download links for Power Keyword in the video below. Let's move on to Power View. Power View is a tool for visualizing data from Power Pivot or the data model. It produces graphs and charts which are interactive. It is found in all Microsoft 365 versions, Excel 2019 versions, Excel 2016 Professional Plus, Excel 2013 Professional Plus, so on. It is not in Excel 2010 because it was first released in Office 2013. This is how Power View looks like on the ribbon and that's the button on the ribbon to be able to acquire the icon on the ribbon we will need to configure the excel ribbon i will need to go to the top right hand corner and right click to get this menu to customize the ribbon click on customize the ribbon and i will come to this window pane i will need to create a specific tab for power view in order to do so i must click on new tab Rename the new tab to Power View. Click OK on it. There it is. And after that, I will need to assign the command to this ribbon. Under popular commands, drop down the list and select all commands. In this listing, I am going to type the character P to go to commands under P. And I'm scrolling down to look for Power View. There it is. So I found it here. And all I got to do now is to select power view and make sure this is selected click the add button make sure that power view is added to the icon in the ribbon i can also opt to select new tab and rename the tab as power view click ok and click ok when complete 
Please also Google Silverlight and install it because it's required to run PowerView. Silverlight is a Microsoft plugin for creating interactive user tools in web and mobile applications. Let's move on to 3D Maps. 3D Maps is a tool to visualize geographical data in 3D from Power Pivot. It is now fully integrated into Excel and no installation is needed. You find this tool in all versions of Microsoft 365, Excel 2019 versions, Excel 2016 Professional Plus, Excel 2013 Professional Plus, and so on. It is not in Excel 2010 because it was first released in Office 2013. How does the tool look like? In the main menu tab, go to insert and look for an icon that looks like this one here. It is called 3D map and if you want to open it, you may drop this down and open 3D map. That's all in relation to 3D map. There is no setup required. I've included reference link in the video below. So check it out. That's all I have in relation to the four business intelligence tools in Excel. Please remember to install or set it up correctly so that you won't face any hitches during the training. Thank you and see you.